Meet the world's largest virtual power plant. Designed with the South Australian government to support the state's energy needs and decrease energy bills across the community. While providing additional stability to the grid. Connecting a growing network of homes and businesses. Commencing with South Australia public housing properties each installed with Tesla Powerwall and solar panels, monitored via the Tesla app. Homes generate and store clean energy for use anytime day or night, even during an outage. Installations have already commenced. Expanding to 50,000 homes over the next few years. It means more jobs, greater visibility, lower energy bills, and less reliance on fossil fuels. Transitioning our world to sustainable energy. Tesla's virtual power plant. Elon Musk once said that Tesla's energy segment of their business would be larger than their vehicle segment. The electric vehicle transition is certainly happening, but Elon Musk knows that the sustainable energy transition is a much more lucrative business. Currently, oil money backs up the richest companies on the earth, like Sinopec Group, Royal Dutch Shell, China National Petroleum Corporation, Saudi Aramco, and even the once thriving Standard Oil Company founded by the richest man in USA's history, John D. Rockefeller. While it may not seem apparent right now with oil prices so low, petroleum is a finite resource and we will eventually run out. With a lower oil concentration, it would cost more to mine the same amount of oil. As a result, assuming demand remains constant, the simple supply and demand rule would tell us that oil prices will increase over the long run. However, with solar panels and energy storages becoming more cost and time efficient as the years pass by, it's almost inevitable that solar panels and energy storage will be used worldwide. And that's when Tesla's virtual power plant comes into play. In 2019, with the cooperation of the South Australian government, Tesla installed thousands of solar panels and power walls all interconnected with wiring so that the Tesla Power Pack 2, which stores energy for a long period of time, can come into play during power outages. Because of the fact that there is so much extra energy stored in these power walls and power packs, with the power walls storing energy throughout the day, this energy can be sold to other areas in the country during power outages, ultimately generating revenue. So far, with only 1,000 homes in the virtual power plant system, the Australian energy market operator, also known as the AEMO, reported revenue of $225,000 in just four months, or roughly 225 US dollars per household. Overall, the total cost of Tesla's virtual power plant in South Australia will amount to an estimated $800 million, pocketing a large amount of profit for Tesla. The partnership of Tesla and the AEMO is mutually beneficial, as it saves a lot of money for the AEMO over the long run, helps citizens get energy, allows Tesla to generate revenue, helps Australia to successfully transition to sustainable energies, and assists Australia during energy outages. As Tesla's solar panels, power walls, power packs, and mega packs become more cost efficient over time, more and more countries will begin to transition to these products as a means of saving money. Already, because of the early success of Australia's virtual power plant, many other areas are starting to follow. National Grid, a utility company based in the US, has been looking to create a Tesla virtual power plant of its own. National Grid customers in Massachusetts or Rhode Island can now enroll their Powerwall in Connected Solutions, a program that links batteries across the state together to create a large supply of sustainable energy to be used during peak demand. You can expect National Grid to request power from your Powerwall for a few hours up to 75 days per year, which is roughly 60 summer days and 15 winter days. During the hottest part of the summer, you can expect an event almost every weekday. Tesla will charge a battery for best event performance and command the battery to discharge during the event. At all other times, you can choose how the battery behaves through your Tesla app. By sharing your power with National Grid, the company estimates that you will obtain 
$1,000 of profit every year, slowly paying off the initial payment of the Tesla Powerwall, which is $8,000. Along with National Grid, many other utility companies are also attempting to expand the virtual power plant. Green Mountain Power, a utility company based in Vermont, looks to offer the Tesla Powerwall for $1,500 down to $6,500 from the full cost of $8,000, as long as you share your energy with Green Mountain Power's virtual power plant. The potential for Tesla to partner with other utility companies in other countries is continuing to grow as time goes on. Earlier in February, it was announced that Tesla was targeting Japan to implement a virtual power plant. With the ramp up of Tesla's virtual power plant all over the world, this would incentivize people to buy Tesla's vehicles as the entire Tesla ecosystem would be able to be managed under the Tesla app. This is all vital for Elon Musk's plan to vertically integrate the sustainable energy market. So, so really, the, one of the key things that happened this year is the, the beginning of the transition of Tesla to a fully integrated sustainable energy company, uh, where um, you have solar uh, creating the energy, uh, then the, the stationary battery pack, the power wall and power pack, storing the energy, and then that energy being used in an electric vehicle. Now, the great thing about this is it's, it's, it, it answers all, it, it's a fully, uh, it's a fully contained energy solution that could, could scale for the whole world. And I'm going to um, get into that for a moment. But it's something where you can imagine as far in the future, well, well, well beyond human civilization, which I hope lasts a really long time. Um, <laughs> Uh, that, that this is something that, that would last for really, you know, this is, this, this works. And, and, and there, I think there are no unanswered questions. Um, you know, even, the, the, even the gigafactory or the gigafactories that, that make these products will be powered by sustainable energy. So, like, I, I really don't think there's any um, hole in, left in the argument, uh, you know, because when we're making electric cars, people would say that, well, they're just, uh, they're really coal powered. And, and there's like the long tailpipe, you know, and the type tailpipe is really over there by the power plant. And we're like, yeah, but you know, we, we're going to have sustainable energy generation too. Um, and, and then, but, but then you can still have gasoline cars. So you've got to have electric cars, sustainable, sustainable energy uh, production, and then you've got to store that energy because the sun don't shine at night. Real simple. One, two, three. <laughs> it has been amazingly difficult to explain this. <laughs> I'm like, there's only three pictures there, man. <laughs> I mean, come on. <laughs> In the stock market, it is important to stay ahead of the game. And Tesla's plan to deploy virtual power plants all over the world is a plan that not many investors know about. Let me know what you think about the virtual power plant in the comment section below. If you guys enjoyed this video, please hit the like button and subscribe. Your support is greatly appreciated.